sustainability is a huge concept at UConn and it's an important value in our operational decision making and our planning for responsible growth. Our new president has really talked about UConn Nation and extending some of our sustainability goals beyond the main campus to our regional campuses like here at Avery Point. So we've done a lot of enhancements to the campus to help our energy conservation. The retro commissioning of the Marine Science Building, which is a whole airflow redesign. In the labs, the air changes are really equate to how much energy we use to heat and cool that air because we exhaust all the air that goes in there. So for high-end labs, you need a lot of air changes. In research that we're doing today in those labs, we didn't need nearly as much air. So those air changes were dropped down, which is less energy to heat. To moving into our Boiler O2 trim package, which is a whole gas savings on that end. Eversource was a team player right from day one working through the project and they were there every step of the way with us. We worked with UConn on a more cost-effective solution and helped them install exhaust controls on three of their main boilers. These controls are now maximizing the overall efficiencies of the systems and have reduced fuel costs. The boilers are running so much smoother, nicer. That equipment is going to last much longer because of that. And to LED lighting, not only is it energy savings, it's uh, labor savings in the long run, but it's also occupant comfort and safety with all of these projects better air flows, better HVAC in the system, better lighting in their areas. The amount of money that we put in versus the amount that we're gonna save in a year's basis, we would pay for the project in two years. All told, the improvements at Avery Point reduced the amount of natural gas consumed by UConn by more than 50,000 cubic feet a year and cut carbon emissions by more than 300 tons annually. Our office coordinates with other departments throughout the university, student organizations, faculty, staff, to develop programs. When the university students see infrastructure being designed to be more efficient and that we're investing in trying to get to carbon neutrality, that commitment is powerful and they, they know it. I teach a lot of the environmental science and policy courses on campus, so my kind of personal role as a faculty member is to raise awareness of my students. I like to let them know that this world is in their hands, that moving forward they're going to take control of this planet. And so, you know, there are different futures that we could have. You've got to imagine the future you want and then you need to figure out how to get there. At this point, for any major university to remain competitive, you, know, you have to start instituting sustainability goals. The sooner we can reduce CO2 emissions, the more impactful it will be. All simulations show that. Well, I think it's important to provide a living and learning experience, to walk the talk. In that way, partnering with Eversource, it's so pragmatic. It's so on point with our goals that we have this expertise and we can share this information and to have the students see that so that it's experiential learning. Sustainability is uh, you know, it's good for the environment. It's good for all of us. I have kids and they're going to be here long after I'm gone. So you know, just because we're facilities and we are the energy user of the campus, we still want to do it in a responsible way.